Hello everyone, welcome to our video. Today I will show you how to transfer crypto from crypto.com to Exodus wallet on your desktop. So the first thing that you have to do is you have to go in the middle button here on the crypto.com wallet app, go to crypto wallet here. And right now here, you will have to select the coin that you want to withdraw, right? So let's say we're on, you know, for example, Kronos, right? What we can do here is we can go transfer and we can go and click withdraw, right? Now we can withdraw to external wallet right here. And uh, as, as you can see, we can add a wallet address, right? So right now what we'll have to do is we'll have to go to Exodus wallet so that we can get that wallet address. Now, once we're on our Exodus wallet on our desktop, go to wallet right here and make sure to go here and search for Kronos. Now, once we're here on Kronos, we can click receive because we want to receive money from crypto.com. So we click on receive here. Then we have to click here, I understand. And then we have to show address on ETH here. And as you can see, we can basically copy this address or right now we can go to our crypto.com wallet to scan this code. So let's do that. So as you can see right now, we can go to add wallet address here and we can basically select the crypto, right? That we want to, um, you know, withdraw. We, we don't want Kronos, right? We want ERC 20 because that's ETH address. And then we can click on the QR code here icon and then we can basically, um, yeah, allow, allow this again. We need to put our password here and then we can scan the QR code like that. And that's pretty much it. So wallet name, wallet name could be Exodus, right? And that's pretty much it. So click done, click continue. And obviously you will need the pass, right? The passcode and yeah, we will have to enable to factor authentication, but you will do this on your own. And yeah, once you do this, you can actually start and yeah, you can uh, transfer crypto from crypto.com to your Exodus wallet. It's really simple after this, right? You just click continue and yeah, that's pretty much it. So if you have any questions or comments, comment down below and we'll make sure to help you out uh, with just that. So thank you guys for watching. We'll see you in the next video.